Hey, welcome to another segment of Cooking with Kevin. Today, it's a great soup recipe, another soup recipe, and this one is so easy. So here we go. This is taco soup. I got this from a college friend, and uh, we have loved it. And so, here's what you're gonna need. One pound of ground beef. We'll brown it and drain it. Also with the ground beef, we're gonna chop up some onion and put it in there and cook it with the hamburger. We always double our recipe, so we've got two cans of kidney beans, two cans of corn, two cans of petite diced tomatoes, two six ounce cans of tomato juice, two eight ounce cans of tomato sauce. But we do double it, we only use one package of taco seasoning and we're gonna need two tablespoons of sugar as well you can cook this on the cook on the uh, stovetop but today I'm gonna use the slow cooker so either way if you're in a big hurry uh, like I said this doesn't take long so you can do it on the stovetop but it goes good in the slow cooker as well because uh, with a busy night ahead of us uh, we'll just be kind of whenever we can grab something to eat so that's why I'm gonna put it in the slow cooker Right now, we're gonna get the hamburger uh, browned up and also get the onion chopped up and get it uh, in with the hamburger and then we'll drain it and then we'll just add the rest of the ingredients. So here we go. All right, we continue on with the taco soup. The best part about this being so simple to make is while well, the hamburger and onions are cooking, if you're doing it in a slow cooker, which by the way, if you are just doing it on the uh, stove top you can use one big pan and just brown your hamburger in it drain it put it right back in and add all the ingredients real simple but with the slow cooker you can just open up everything you're gonna need and dump it in the slow cooker and bam it is ready to go waiting for the hamburger to get poured in there so we are gonna start with the kidney beans they're going to remain undrained because you're going to want the extra liquid. So we will dump in the two cans of kidney beans. Again, remember we double everything here, except for the taco seasoning. We found that it was just too strong with two packages of taco seasoning. And we only use a pound of hamburger, which is plenty. <clears throat> uh, let's see, we've got the kidney beans. Now the two cans of corn undrained as well. There's one, and two. Next up, we have got the petite chopped, or petite diced, whichever, tomatoes. I think I got a slightly larger size diced tomato this time, but that's all right. So two cans of those. Two cans of tomato juice, which actually, after I thought about it, they're six ounces, so there's probably a 12 ounce can that you can get, like a soda pop size can. But we always get the six pack, so that way you've just got them here. So if you decide, hey, we want taco soup, we can just grab a couple of these and dump them in. So there goes your tomato juice, your tomato sauce. And the taco seasoning, no, it doesn't go in the hamburger, it goes in the soup. All right, so we've got the hamburger in there. We're gonna stir it all together, get it mixed up real good. And bam, we have got uh, taco soup. I've got it on low already. We'll put the lid on here and just let it sit for the afternoon. And it will taste so good come supper time later. Now, once you get ready for that taco soup and get it dished up, here's what you're gonna want for your toppings. Shredded cheese. If you like sour cream, sour cream. Fritos. 
Those will be your toppings for your taco soup. There is the final product for taco soup. I've added the shredded cheese and the Fritos. Um, you can also add sour cream. I'm just not a fan of it, but if you enjoy sour cream with your tacos, you will love it in your taco soup. So there you have it, taco soup. Hey, thanks for watching, and keep tuning in for another segment of Cooking with Kevin. Bye.